Alpat Labs, Dr. Lal Pat Labs, Ekka, tell us. Well, yes, uh, you know, Dr. Lal's Pat Labs, um, a couple of important takeaways from Om Manjanda of uh, the company on margins. Remember that the margins have recovered all the way to around 29.6%, so almost 30 odd percent in terms of margins. Multiple reasons that led to margin expansion as per the company. The price increases was one of the reasons for the margin expansion that they took. Uh, they had taken a price increase in the month of Feb. Margins were also aided by a product mix. The margins, however, it might just be an aberration and the margins, according to the company, will be around 26% going forward. Growth guidance, confident on double-digit growth, should look at low double-digit growth in, uh, in terms of early teens, in terms of revenue in FY24. Further price increases, price increases is a last resort for the company. They would like to move back to volume growth of around 7-8% to CAGR. So that's their <clears throat> next target. Discounting. Steep discounting has now gone away and the intensive intensity of competition is less. So basically, they're looking more at value growth as compared to just volume growth. So quality of the, of the testing uh, company also matters. And that's basically what we've heard across, you know, Metropolis, Dr. Lal's. That is not just about price anymore. It is also about quality and trust. Okay. And in fact, uh, you know, uh, the management, when we spoke to them, they were very confident about the way forward in the business. They say that, you know, competition is something that has come and gone. Mm -hmm. Pricing issues are something that has come and gone, but their quality continues to sustain. So that's a big move coming in on Dr. Lal Path Labs. But let's do one thing. Let's take a quick commercial break on that note. On the other side, P.S. Patel, the chairman and managing director of uh, PSP Projects, will be discussing the company's performance for the quarter gone by. Stay tuned.